What's up YouTube? Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to make your first iPhone or iPod Touch theme. Now I will not show you how to switch the sounds or anything because I don't know how to do that but I will show you how to switch the icons, your slider, basically all this stuff um, and make your own theme then get your own repo and put it in the city and that's how it's going to work. Uh, first plug in your device which I will do right now I'm gonna use my iPod touch and remember it has to be jailbroken so let me just turn the camera right, plug this in back and plug it in now you will need an FTP client to do this you need to SSH into your iPhone or iPod touch I'm gonna use Cyberduck I'm just open it up and if you don't know how to SSH you can look at my previous video or no two videos ago it's called how to SSH into iPhone or iPod touch you can look at that and um, I'm just gonna do it right now sorry that's my website all right um, let me get my IP address SFTP. Remember, if you don't know how to do this, just use my previous video. One of my previous videos. Alright, now you're in and you can close your FTP client once you SSH in. Um, now you're going to go to this website. or Well, first, go to your desktop and create a new folder and call it whatever you want your theme to be called. Alright? So I'm just going to name mine My Slacker Mind Test. All right. That's going to be the name of my thing. You can all see that, My Slacker Mind Test. Um, and you're going to open that up. And I'll make this easier for you guys. And you're going to create, create a new folder in here called Icons with a capital I. Make sure that I is capital for icons, all right? And you just leave that folder right in there. And let me just uh, check my theme to see what I did. To all right. Um, now you're gonna create another uh, folder in your theme and call it bundles. B u n d l e s with a capital B. And once you open up bundles, just I gotta get this name. You're going to create another folder inside that called com, C O M, dot apple, dot telephony, U I. Alright? So it's going to look like that. Ju exactly how I have it. Alright? And that will be to switch your slider, your slider image. And that's all I'm going to show you today. Um. So let's get started. Uh, you have your theme right here. I'm just going to close this and leave my theme right there. You're going to open up your internet and you're going to go to this website, which is probably the best website you can go to. It's called dryicons.com. D R Y I C O N S. And you're going to click on free icons. And there's going to be tons of free icons. You can scroll through all the pages and stuff. Um, I'm just gonna. Hmm. Uh, you're gonna click view download on whichever one you want, and those icons are. Yeah, I guess I'll just use that. All right, and um, you're gonna download the .png icon set. It doesn't matter. See, that says Windows, Linux, and Mac. It doesn't matter. Download the .png icon set because that's the one you need for iPhone or iPod Touch. And once that's done downloading, it'll show up in your wherever you downloaded it. And I'll minimize this. Open up my downloads. And it is right here. Unzip it. And let me 
me drag this to my desktop. Now this this part is very important. Um, once you open up the theme that you just downloaded or the icons that you just downloaded, open up PNG, the folder, and drag. We see where it says 48 by 48. That's the folder you want. All right, because 64 by 64 is too big and 32 by 32 is too small and 128 by 128 is way too big. So you're going to use 48 by 48. Drag that to your desktop and open it up. And all your icons are going to be in there. All right. So let me just go. Make sure you have winter board. You also need winter board. So let me just go on my winter board and take off my theme that I have right now. So it's just regular. I'll show you what it looks like. It's just the normal theme. You see all the icons are pretty big. Alright, that's the normal theme. Now open up your theme that you just made. And open up the icons folder. And there will be nothing in there, obviously. And choose anything you want. I'm going to um, see uh, this movie track png you're gonna switch the name of that to videos that's what I like it says videos if you go to your iPod touch or iPhone or well, not iPhone but iPod touch the name of the application is called videos so you're gonna rename that videos with a capital V remember everything has to have a capital in front of it um, and you drag that into the icons thing this is really easy actually and how about I make this one notes with a capital N you just drag it right into the folder um, make this settings capital S um, make this contacts capital C and make this um, iTunes capital or with a lowercase i just how it's spelled on your device because iTunes is lowercase i and you know and that's all I'll use right now and I'll drag this see that arrow I'm gonna use that as my slider so I'm just gonna drag that to my desktop so I know where it is and let me just arrange these in a better order alright good enough alright now that's your theme so far now let's go to bundles go back and open up bundles open up com.apple.telephonyui and you're gonna name this um, let me make sure the name the name is pretty odd but it works All right, you're gonna name this. Uh, rename it. Bottom bar knob gray. All right, so it's gonna look like that. Bottom bar knob gray dot png, and make sure they're all dot png. 